Yeah. All right, so we found our first dusky salamander of the year. Right there. We found a couple of them down here in the small stream. All right. Here's a big dusky sal. Here's a big dusky salamander. I just turned over in a rock. Uh, they're not rare or anything, but this one's pretty big. Cool to find. I'm gonna put him back where I found him. Right in this muck right here. Just really cool specimen. You can see pretty big. So today, me and my dog are in Baltimore County. Be checking out some spots. Looking for some salamanders. Trying to find some vernal pools. We'll see what we find. So I'm at these vernal pools. Just came across a newt, eastern spotted newt, red spotted newt in the water phase. Looking for other salamanders. I don't see any. I'm gonna let him go Here's back. Here's this newt. I'm gonna let him go back on his way. See if I see any more salamanders in here. Here's some egg masses. I believe these are wood frogs or spring peepers. See right there. Yeah, there's wood frogs. There's wood frogs mating. Right there. So these are all wood frogs. So here's a small vernal pool with some egg masses. Probably wood frog, I'd have to say. So I know it's kind of cold, but we're gonna look for Jefferson salamanders, maybe find some uh, eggs. Uh, we're gonna head to a vernal pool spot. Um, like I said, I know it's cold, but it's the middle of March. So spotted and Jefferson's should have their eggs out. Maybe we'll see some marbled larvae. Swimming. So we're at these vernal pools and it's pretty frozen. I don't even see any egg masses, but I'm gonna check around. But I remember this time last year we found spotted egg masses. There was a salamander. Here's a marbled. Good find, Tommy. Now marbled don't breed now, they breed in the fall. But nonetheless, it's a beautiful specimen. I'll take some pictures, then we'll move them out and get them back on our log. Here's that marbled. So we'll try to look at this pool, see if we see any larvae. So to put him back, we flip the log back to its original position. Then I'm gonna get him to crawl back under here. Then I'm gonna pack it and seal it with leaves. Here's an Eastern Newt or Red Spotted Newt. It's two salamanders for the day. I guess I can't be that mad. We still don't find any Jeffersons or Spotters. So here's a deer skull and you can see it's got some gnaw marks on it from the rodents that chew on it to uh, sharpen their teeth and for the calcium. So here's a very small uh, Eastern Redback, Plethodon cinereus, smallest I've ever seen. And He's in the uh, red phase. I'm gonna get him back on his log. And here's that Eastern Redback. Very small guy. So we just flipped a pretty decent sized spotted salamander underneath this rock. Ambistoma maculatum. Surprised we didn't find more. And there's also an Eastern Redback under the same one, a small one. So this is the breeding season for these guys. Me and my brother up here before, we saw so many egg masses, but today looked like we only saw one. I, it was too far out in the vernal pool. I couldn't tell if it was a uh, spotted or a Jefferson, but um, I'm gonna get this guy back and found four, four different species of salamanders today, so it's not that bad. Today I'm in Baltimore County, Be going to a vernal pool, looking to see if I can't find any amphibians. I hear some spring peepers. But I have not encountered anything else. But we'll check out some of these pools up here. So I believe these are wood frog egg masses. But I do believe there is a spotted egg mass right here. If it's 
I think that's what that is. Holy wild turkeys. Look at all these wild turkeys. A whole bunch of them. Gotta be at least 20. There's at least 20 wild turkeys in this field. It's cool to see. York County, PA. Here's a dead thing. State Park. Normally don't see dead mink. Or I mean you normally don't see mink. I know they're probably more nocturnal. But it's got all these flies and stuff around it. So I was just hiking here and I noticed something brown. It's a mink. Right here. Cool creatures. If you ever get the chance, watch Mink Man on YouTube. I don't know how this guy died. Who cool nonetheless? I know it's dead. Mink are awesome, awesome carnivores. So here's some vernal pools. And that cloudy white mass right there is a spot, spotted salamander egg mass. So here, here are some wood frog egg masses on this small vernal pool. Um, these vernal pools with no fish are very important for the amphibians.